Hey everybody, it's Jay Kitchen from jaysbeard.com. I hope you're doing really well today. We are doing a review of something that's been talked about a lot on a number of fragrance influencers channels. This is the Imperium from Electimus. Check out the bottle that comes in. It's pretty pretty actually. And in the meantime, if you could subscribe, smash that thumbs up button and hit the notifications bell, we would really, really appreciate it. Like I said, I heard about this on one of the influencers that might have been Curly Fragrance. I don't really remember who. I do believe she's kind of hyped it up somewhat. It's a unisex fragrance. It was launched in 2020. The nose behind the fragrance is Sophia Bardelli. So the notes from the brand. Imperium was a supreme executive power held by the intellectual and political giants of the ancient world, requiring great intellect, presence, ambition, success, influence, and popularity. This sparkling aromatic citrus fragrance confidently opens with bergamot and coriander underpinned by a light woody base and is elegantly balanced by its light floral heart. Very nice, very floral as it were. Main accords as listed on Fragrantica are white floral, citrus, vanilla, woody, powdery, aromatic, fresh spicy, musky, soft spicy, and warm spicy. So you're getting a lot of spices in there. The top notes, bergamot, coriander. The middle notes, jasmine, lily, saffron, neroli, tuberose, and rose, so really floral. The base notes, vanilla, musk, guaiac wood, patchouli, amber and agar wood, also known as oud. So on, on Fragrantica, they have this part of the, the commentary on the particular perfume or cologne where people chime in and say what this fragrance reminds them of. Now, the three top remind me of for this are Nishane Ani, Nishane Ani X, Hachivat, and Aventus. Now, I've smelled all three of those, and I like them all. Now, reviewed the Hachivat and the Ani and Ani X, and they're, all three of those are really nice scents. Um, now, a lot of people say this is sort of like a combination of some of them. I don't know about that. You know, we put it on about, I don't know, four hours ago, maybe even five hours ago. It's turned into a skin scent very very florally now my skin doesn't really hold this type of scent that well it's very pleasant really clean super fresh this is a really good summer scent now if some people say you could wear it three seasons you know not in winter it kind of depends on your body chemistry i think to a really huge extent because this yeah, I could wear it. I just don't see, unless I kind of super sprayed myself, which is not my style, but I think if you want to be noticed or at least have some sort of a scent impression or sillage or whatever, you kind of do have to really put it on there. I mean, it depends on the fragrance, obviously, but it's got a really nice, that, that bergamot citrus, really clean. And that kind of stays with it as it dries down, but it does kind of dry down to a skin scent after about, for me, after about three and a half to four hours. Now, other people are gonna have greater projection. I don't typically spray uh, perfume or cologne on my clothing, but I suspect if you did that, it would linger far longer. It's really delicious. Now, the price point on this for 100 ml, if you go to their website, Electimus's website, it lists for 250 bucks. I have seen it discounted as low as 100 to, you know, a little bit higher than that, 118, 148, in that range. So you can get it for a significant markdown. Now I'm looking at $85. I don't know if that's 100 mLs. The bottom line is you can get it for less than the $250 list price. It's very nice. Definitely unisex. I mean, I think it leans a little bit more feminine, but Nice summer fragrance.
really very nice if you're interested in these types of fragrances i'd get a decant of it check it out sun split wherever there's a lot of different places if you go on the web to get a decant for under 10 bucks and just kind of wear it around and see if you like it if you like the review if it was helpful to you smash the thumbs up button the notifications bell subscribe if you've not done so already please leave comments down below if you've tried this or similar fragrances and what you think if you like it if you hate it or anything in between in the meantime please be kind to our fellow human beings their critters stay lifted stay well groomed stay smelling effing awesome and we'll catch you on the next one cheers everybody we love you